Let's begin by editing a page in the new editor. Click Create and select the type of page that you want to create. The page will be opened in the Edit mode in the new editor. For this demo, let's select the Decision template to create a page for deciding about the order of search results in Rocket Hub's app. For a decision page, provide information for various fields, such as status, decision, owner, and stakeholders. After providing the relevant details, click Create. The page will be created and opened in the Edit mode in the new editor. In the newly created page, add or edit content as required. For this demo, let's add some content related to Rocket Hub's app-related decision discussions. You can also format your content by formatting the text, adding tables, adding links, and more. You will learn about formatting content in Confluence Pages later in this course. You may save the Work in Progress page as a draft that you can access and update later. To save a page as a draft, click Close. All your changes will be saved. The page will close without getting published, and you will be taken to your Confluence Cloud home. Now that you have saved a draft, let's see how to access this draft. To access your saved draft, first visit your Confluence Cloud home. Then, from the Recent Pages section, select the Drafts tab. All your saved drafts will be listed under the tab. From the listed drafts, click the draft that you want to open. The draft will open in the new editor. Let's now learn how to publish a page. Once you finalize the content for a page, you need to publish the page so that it is available for others, such as your team members or visitors to your space, to view or edit. Publishing the page closes the editor and takes you back to viewing the page. Before publishing a page, you can also preview how the published page will appear. To do so, from the ellipsis menu, select Preview. You can also press the Control, Shift, and E keys together on your keyboard as a shortcut for previewing a page. To publish a page, ensure that you have the page opened in the editor and click Publish. You can press the Control and Enter keys together on your keyboard as a shortcut for publishing a page. Once a page is published, you can find it in the Page tree under the parent page from which it was created. Next, let's see how to edit a published page. Publishing a page doesn't mean that you cannot make any more changes to the page. If you need to make updates to a published page, you can edit the page. To edit a published page, ensure that you have the published page open. Next, click the Edit icon on top of the page to open the page in the editor. You can also press the E key on your keyboard as a shortcut for opening the page in the editor. Now, make the required edits to the page. Once you are done with the edits, you can either publish the page or save the page as a draft. Let's now look at the steps to delete a draft. There may be times when you don't want to continue with the page and want to delete its draft. To delete a draft, first ensure that the draft is open in the editor. From the ellipsis menu on the top right, select Delete Unpublished Page. 
you will be prompted to confirm the delete action. Note that deleting a draft is permanent and can't be undone. Click Delete Page to proceed with deleting the draft. The draft will be deleted and removed from the list under the Drafts tab. That brings us to the end of this video on drafting, editing, and publishing pages. In this video, you learned how to edit and save a page draft in the new editor of Confluence, access a saved draft, publish a draft, edit a published page, delete a draft.